Hello Aries, this is your mid-January 2019 reading. Fire sign, your energy, taking domination. But this is for Aries. Mid-January 2019, five card spread, middle of the month reading for Aries. The general population of Aries, general reading. January mid-January 2019. This will not resonate with all Aries, so please keep that in mind. And if you would like to be notified of future videos, please hit subscribe and the notification bell right below. But I want to see what the income and energies for this mid-month reading for Aries. Income and energy. See what it is. Taking control, making final decisions in your life. Things that are meaningful. You will, in the uh, income energy, decide on something. And like I said, it will be final. The decision, whatever decision you make. In the past, there was some gain. You got the Nine of Pentacles. Maybe you're earning more money, bringing more money to yourself, or just lucrative, you know, prospects are coming towards you in the past, or were coming towards you in the past. Obstacle. Not necessarily liking what is handed to you, though, with the Four of Cups. You may feel like the offers that you're getting are not what you're wanting. Even though in the past you had gain. Current environment or the subject at hand. No longer taking a break. Not, no longer holding out. No longer keeping hidden from the public and people around you. More or less, some of you also, may, a few of you may have been sick and in recovery now. Outside environment, there's some change coming your way. Makes sense with all the planets starting to go direct, or a lot of the planets are going direct that were kind of in retrograde for a long time. I'm going to keep this overturned until I clarify these others. I do not want this last card, the final outcome, to influence me. I'm going to use this deck for clarifiers. I do shuffle my decks prior and meditate on each sign before I even start this video. But let's find out why the Nine of Pentacles is there in the past for Aries. Why are you in the past for Aries, Nine of Pentacles? Give me a card. Why are you there? King of Swords. Hmm. You were dealing with the King of Swords. The King of Swords could be an air sign or someone taking on that energy. It could be Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. They are in reverse. doesn't tell me much. just tells me this person is involved. Whatever gain was occurring in the past. Maybe you were gaining something, even though this king is turned around. And more or less could be the reason why you're gaining is because you're taking on this energy. And you're not being Mr. or Mrs. Nice Guy about it. You're just taking on control with that Aeon coming up in the beginning, making a final decision. And maybe people didn't like it around you, how you, uh, how you communicated your situation to others. Can I get another card for the Nine of Pentacles and the King of Swords for the past element for Aries? Someone contemplating on how to make bigger gains in the past, too. I'm feeling like, for a few of you, you may be taking on that sword's energy and deciding what you want, and others may not think you have a filter. They may feel like your, your speech is abrupt, and you're going to tell people how you're going to work your life and get your gain, because this is Seven Pentacles contemplating on how you're going to get something done. 
as the obstacle. You got the four cups. I told you before, it's like not like what, what is being offered to you. You are getting offers, but you're kind of, eh, I don't know if this is what I want. Four of cups in the upright. Why are you there as an obstacle for Aries? January, mid-January 2019. Hmm. Four of Swords. Had that already. You were taking a bit of a break. Maybe you went on vacation. Maybe, you know, for the holidays. Like I told, you know, earlier that some of you may have been sick. Because that's the Four of Swords again. Over here it's in reverse. So you're definitely coming out of whatever that Four of Swords energy is. Can I get another... Uh, card. It could be that you're wanting to take a break for some of you. Now, you do not feel like whatever offer is being handed to you is a good offer because it may cost you in the long run. And you know, with the Four of Swords, you also may be mulling, mulling about it, thinking about it still. Say, I'm going to go on holiday or take a break and think about what I want. But with the subject at hand or the current environment, you're coming out of that break mode. Four of Swords in reverse. Four of Swords, why are you there? For Aries. In reverse, why are you there? Ten of Swords in reverse. Coming out of feeling betrayed, stabbed in the back. No longer taking a break. Can I get another card? Could have to do with partnerships, two of cups in reverse. So I'm thinking some of you are no longer taking this break at the, at, the, at least by mid January. You're going to start coming out of your shell, even though you felt stabbed in the back before. It's a past situation, but the card is still there. You're still feeling it, but you're coming out of it. It could have to do with a partnership, whether lover family, friends, co-workers, it doesn't matter. It's more of an emotional energy, though. And they're in reverse, so it has something to do with a partnership also. Now, what you have coming towards you, or the outside environment, is two of pentacles. It's a change. It's about changing things. It's about getting on top of things and juggling two different things at the same time, trying to get keep things afloat. But change is coming. Two of Pentacles, why are you there for Aries as the outside environment or what's coming towards them? Knight of Cups, maybe there's some change with the Knight of Cups. It could be a water sign, could be a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. But maybe, I don't know, maybe they're wanting to change things up with you. Maybe you got this person in your life. And things are changing around them and it's coming towards you. Or they want to change things with you. Can I get another card for the Knight of Cups? And the Two of Pentacles. Why are you there? Knight of Swords energy. I believe it was a King of Swords over here. Knight of Swords. I'm thinking it's the same energy. Someone has no filter. It's an outside environment now, I'm saying this. Someone has no filter, and they come across kind of abrupt. And they may be, like I said, I think someone's wanting to change with you. They're wanting to change something up. Maybe that you had an argument. Maybe that stab in the back feeling that you had. But things are changing with them, whatever it is, emotionally. They still kind of have no filter, and they may come across wrong if they try to present themselves to you, and I don't know how you're going to take it. All Aries are different. You can leave it in the comments. How would you take this? Someone coming towards you wouldn't change. Maybe to be with you or to work with you or have, just have a conversations. But like I said, this person has you know doesn't have a filter. It's an outside environment. Final outcome, coming out of heartbreak, possibly. I need another card to know for sure. Three of Swords in reverse, why are you there for Aries? King of Pentacles, someone taking on their crown, could be an earth sign or someone 
acting like an earth sign, you know, take it on that energy. It could be uh, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. So some of you may be coming out of heartbreak with an earth sign or someone who is kind of, you know, responsible. They weren't before. They had turned themselves around because they are in the upright. Um, so they're the kind of person that people go to advice for. They're looked up to. They sound secure in their mind. You know, they got a good standing in the community usually. But I see coming out of heartbreak with the King of Pentacles possibly. I need another card. Three of Swords, King of Pentacles. Why are you there for Aries? That's the final outcome. Yep, possibly coming out of heartbreak with a lover. Lovers is still in reverse. The, the, the pain is still a little bit there, or this card would not show up. But it's in reverse. People say, sometimes readers will say, it's someone who's staying in heartbreak and there's nothing that can hurt them anymore. It's done. But I see this person recovering when it's in reverse. I see there's nothing more you can bleed out. They're going to start recovering now. They're going to start healing. They're not going to forget. Aries ain't going to get, they're not going to forget, they're not, or the people around them. But I do see it coming out of heartbreak with a lover. I don't know if you'll be getting back together with this person or not. I just think it's not going to be as intense for you. Can I get another one more card and then I'm going to move on. Three of uh, swords, king of pentacles, and the lovers in reverse while you're there. Yeah, there's still some harsh words there. You may have harsh words to this person. They may have harsh words for you. But remember, I told you someone wants change with you, but the filter is still not right how they're speaking and how they're presenting themselves to you, or you're not accepting it right now. You are, you know, it is easing up, like I said with whoever's around you, but it's still very much there and words may be cutting. They also may be trying to see what you're doing online, see if maybe can they approach you. And sometimes this is you doing that to them, looking them up online, trying to see what they're up to. But change is coming, coming towards you. Someone wants it with you. And I see you coming out of heartbreak. It's still there a little bit. You, you haven't forgotten it, like I said but you're coming out of it. You also feel a little out of sorts with the queen of rods or wands. This is a, could be your energy as an Aries. It's a fire sign, Leo or Sagittarius. You're still, like I said, feeling a little turned around. Like I said, you haven't forgotten it. I know, uh, what's that old saying? I can forgive, but I never forget. That's it. That's what Aries will be feeling at the end. Even though the pain is lifting from the par all parties here, it's still kind of there a little bit. So let these energies pass as the major planets go direct so things move forward pretty quickly. And I'll be giving you another reading before February, hopefully, and see what energies have changed because I'm sure they're going to. Like I said, if you want to know when my uh, readings come up, Hit the notification and subscribe, and I'll talk to you later, Aries. Bye.